people stuck in the house in Nairobi and you asking yourself what is there to do in Nairobi where can I go what is there to see I have 10 things for you that you can do in Nairobi Nairobi is one of the largest and still growing cities in Africa and the only city in the world with a national park in it Nairobi National Park with background of the city and wide open grass plains, sea animals like cheetah, lions, buffalo, giraffes, rhinos, and much more. You can also enjoy picnic sites and campsites. The forest, if you remember our beloved Wangari Madai, who fought for the forest to be kept and developed to serve as the green lungs of Nairobi and not an amusement park. Visitors can enjoy walking, jogging, uh, dog walking, picnic, and much more. ICC, Kenya International Conventional Center, is a 28-story building located in the city square Nairobi, one of the tallest buildings in Kenya. It holds a number of government offices, get best views of the city from the rooftop, and make memorable skyline pictures. David Shedrick Wildlife Trust is the most successful orphan elephant rescue and rehabilitation program in the world. It's a very popular touristic attraction. You get to see the star feed the elephants and watch the small elephants rub themselves on the mud and you can touch them and rub on them as they walk close to you. Next aim is to showcase and educate on Kenyans' rich heritage. The materials and artwork used in the fabrication of outdoor sculptures and garden links to Kenya heritage, which is nature, culture, history, and contemporary art. There is shopping facilities and eating areas as well and gardens. It is open throughout. It is 10 minutes from the Nairobi city and can be accessed by public or private transport. The Giraffe Center is a non-profit organization. The first giraffe at the center was in 1979. It was founded by the late Jock Leslie Melville and his wife Betty Leslie Melville when they discovered the sad plight of the Rothschild giraffe found only in the grassland of East Africa. You can learn about the giraffe and learn about the center. Feed the giraffes is also a nice place to take your kids. You can spot some war dogs too. You can get there by public transportation or by private transportation. Kalai Market is an open-air marketplace featuring vendors selling colorful African handmade jewelry, arts, bags, wooden masks, and much more. You have to negotiate for everything. Bomas of Kenya is a touristic village in Langata, Nairobi. It was established by the government in 1971 and is 10 kilometers from the central. It displays traditional villages belonging to the Kenyan tribe and traditional dances from different ethnic Kenyan groups. Bomas is from Swahili word Boma. Is an, you can enjoy African food from the Utamaduni restaurant. It's a place where you can go hiking either by yourself or with your friends. It's located southwest near Nairobi. It overlooks the Nairobi National Park and the Nairobi City. Its peak is at 8,071 feet above sea level. You can spot buffaloes, wild pigs, pocher pines, and much more. The Kibera Slam Tour is the largest slam in Africa. A very eye-opening experience. Gives you insight of lives of millions of Kibera residents. 
with their daily life experience, they strive to make their lives better and much more. It costs around 2,500 Kenya shillings per person, which provides employment and improves the life of the people. <laughs>